Hey everybody, welcome back to Magic Orthodoxy. My name is David and this is a Magic Review. Hey everybody, welcome back to the channel. Today, we're gonna look at a really cool DVD just got released, Digits of Deception from Alan Warrison and Big Blind Media. But before we get into that, let me tell you really quick what it is I do. I review magic tricks, I review playing cards, I do giveaways every single month. Before you spend your hard-earned paper route money on that next magic trick because you watched the trailer, you read the ad copy, some magician on some forum said that this was an amazing trick and you're like, oh, I've got to have it. Before you spend that PayPal dollar, head on down to Uncle David's because I do honest and factual reviews every single time. I want you to buy magic you're going to perform. I want you to buy magic you're going to love. All right, Digits of Deception, Alan Morrison, Big Blind Media. Let's talk about it. All right, so I always ask the same exact questions and I always have the same exact format because it keeps me from rambling on and on and on. Uh, what do you get? What do you get when you order this? It is a DVD. It is only a DVD. It is a DVD only, okay? Which means even though there are props used, gimmicks used for most of these effects, you will be making those purchases separately and building them yourself. Really quick, what's the overall quality and production value of the video? Uh, you got Alan in the Big Blind Media Red Room. Every performance is about two minutes long. Every explanation is about four to five minutes long. And some of them also include a second video that explains how to build your gimmicks. All right, so what is taught on the DVD? What are you gonna learn? Uh, the first trick is called Bud's Bottle. It is a almost impromptu. I'll say almost impromptu. It says impromptu on the ad copy, but it's almost impromptu. It's an almost impromptu coin through bottle effect and you don't need the special coin uh, to do it, okay? But it uses a, you know, brown beer bottle that you'd find at a bar, okay? And uh, a coin. The next trick is called Rory's Rise, and it is Rory's version of Ray's Rise by Ray Cosby. One of the other tricks on there is called Key Thing, and this is my favorite trick on the entire DVD. Not just because it's fun and visual, but because I didn't have to build anything. <laughs> Uh, use a regular, you could use the ring off your finger and your house key, okay? I'd use a house key, not a car key. I'd use a house key. And you just show how the key won't go all the way through your ring, right? And then with no gimmicks and virtually no cover, you shove the key right through the ring. And when you release, the ring is really on there and you could hand it out. There's nothing to find. Fries with that is Alan's version of McDonald's Aces. Static is a really beautiful card levitation effect that you can do with no prep right in front of the spectator. Uh, you can touch your two fingers to the top card and it'll rise off the deck. And then you can actually have your spectator do it. They do it also, and there's no threads, no magnets, no smoke, no mirrors, nothing. Then there's Sharpie Bend, and it is exactly what it says. You walk out with a Sharpie marker and you bend it, and then you end with a bent Sharpie and it's a great visual. Aces Out is a beautiful mental trick and it is completely self-working. You take out all four aces, you have the spectator place their hand over the top of the packet, uh, they name one of the aces, and then when you, they raise their hand, that ace is gone. You then spread through the deck, that ace is face up in the spread, and then when you flip the deck over, the entire deck is blank. And then the last trick is called Be Safe. You show your audience a cigarette lighter and the little no one under 18 sticker that's glued to the bottom. You then use your thumbnail and instantly show how it's easy to slide the sticker cleanly off. They see the sticker in your hand and then in a blink, 
it flies back and adheres right back on to the lighter. You can hand it out and it can be examined. Is it well made? Like I said, you make everything. <laughs> you make everything. There's no props in this, so you will need to buy extra things for all these. And I didn't fully go into every single trick uh, in the explanation because I wanna tell you now what some of the things are that you will need, just so that you're aware of what additional purchases you will be making. The Sharpie bend requires you to melt a standard Sharpie marker. So you will need to use something hot to do that. Um, Bud's bottle requires you to purchase a foreign coin. Aces out requires a blank deck and four aces and two spectators. Fries with that requires you to make a custom gimmicked card. Rory's Rise needs a special material. Be Safe needs a lighter and some custom artwork and a very attractive friend. Positives, all right, so what are the positives to this DVD? This DVD is the perfect example of Alan Warson's creativity, his outside the box thinking. If you've ever followed him on social media before, you know just kind of what a very creative person he is. And sometimes when you get these DVD collections, it feels like, oh, there's some filler in there. There's uh, that one trick I would never do. Or there's like two ace routines, right? Or two or three sandwich routines. And you're like, man, couldn't you just give me your best sandwich routine instead of three? With this one, it really felt like there's no filler at all. These are all fun. And there's certainly something here for everyone. Negatives. All right, so what are the negatives? You know, every single time I do a review, I'm always going to give you the good and the bad. I'm going to show you both sides of the coin. Uh, and I've pretty much already mentioned it, right? I've been saying it since the beginning. You are gonna make additional purchases. How much is this DVD? It's $25. $25, you're just getting teaching. You will need to go out and spend your money on the other things. But this is the great thing about this DVD, I think, is you can just start with one, right? Start with your favorite one, build that one. You could build another trick in a month or two, right? There's no rush. Like, you can take your time. So there's no need for you to run out and buy everything, and there's no need for you to run out and build everything unless you want to. So you could, you could take your time, but just be aware there are some extra purchases and a lot to build. Who would like this? I think anyone that loves Alan Morrison's magic. I think that if you've seen the trailer and you've seen some of the effects and you're thinking, I really want to learn how to do that. I think any one of these tricks is worth the price of the DVD. Definitely. Because they're all just super fun. They're, they're totally magic eye candy, right? And I think if somebody saw you do one of these tricks, you could be instantly associated with the guy. You're the guy that does that thing. You bent the deep, you bent the Sharpie marker with your mind, right? Or whatever. So yeah, it's a really fun DVD. And as far as other channels or other places you could watch a review about this DVD, head on down to Straight Talk Magic Reviews. Straight Talk Magic Reviews also did a review for this. So make sure that they are your second opinion before you purchase. I want to thank Alan Morrison. I want to thank Big Blind Media for allowing me to have this DVD so that I could do the review for you. And if you'd like to purchase it for yourself, you can head on down to bigblindmedia.com. Thanks, guys. I'll see you next time. Bye.